Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the various forms of enterprises, guys. So basically, enterprises are nothing but in simple words, you can say the companies, guys. Okay, yes. We are having five different popular types, guys. So th that thing we'll be discussing in this lecture. Okay, so the first type is nothing but the solo proprietorship so from the name only you can say solo means a single guy right yes so a business owned and operated by a single individual okay yes so the major advantage here is ease and cost of a formation so basically everything will be done by him only right yes so there will be no misunderstandings no issues no nothing no no problems right yes but the only disadvantage is if something goes wrong he is responsible for everything right so he need to pay the debt he need to he might lose everything whatever he has guys because he whenever we start a company or someone starts a company they will be investing their whole in their in the company right yes so that is the reason why if something goes wrong there will be a huge disaster for him right yes similarly partnership firm so basically here from this word you can say partnership means here two or more so a business that is owned and operated by two or more members okay so the exam so the advantage here is great availability of finance so basically if you need money like assume that the other guy is rich so he will be investing money and he'll be taking some shares but he will let you be in the company and you the company will be running normally right yes so that in that way the financials will help the disadvantage is nothing but each partner is responsible for the actions of all all the others so basically assume that two or more right so assume that you are having a 10 members here so basically among these 10 one guy is too much naughty or too much aggressive with the things so he'll be taking some kind of odd decisions always so in that situation if he does something wrong and led to the whole company loss in this situation all other nine will affect guys so this is the major disadvantage of okay it is the major disadvantage of partnership firm guys okay yes so the next type is nothing but a limited partnership okay so limited partnership business ownership involvement involves a combination of a solo proprietor and a general proprietor okay so these are called as limited partnership they have the liability to the fund investment by them so basically here all are not equal guys so we will be having some solo proprietorship he is the boss and general proprietorship okay so the advantage is here here is nothing but shared responsibilities of work so basically they are all equal and the share works among them but the only disadvantage is nothing but limited partners do not have do not have much to say in decision making so basically the limited partners so i told you right so limited partners will not be having any right to change the idea to give some ideas right so they can give them my give, the, give some ideas express their ideas but they cannot force to select that idea only right yes so that is the only disadvantage here similarly the next type is nothing but a joint stack company okay so under these joint stack companies we are having both private and public so private companies are nothing but companies owned and traded privately okay similarly public limited are nothing but companies owned and traded publicly yes i think i wrote in the reverse way it's okay yes okay okay so let us continue so the last type is nothing but non-profitable organizations so basically these are not expecting money from us guys so basically they are doing things for their well-being and all those things so those comes under this are non-profitable organizations okay yes so i hope everyone got a clear idea on this so in the next lecture we will be discussing about the environmental influence on entrepreneurship so basically if you want to start a company what others will say so that things we will be discussing in our next lecture guys okay yes so let us meet in the next lecture thank you thanks for watching